the Department of Defense is America's largest government agency. Our mission is to provide the military forces needed to deter war and ensure our nation's security. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky is set to meet privately with Republican and Democratic lawmakers to request more support in the fight against Russia. The Ukrainians are caught up in a fight for democracy, the very democracy we love itself. Zelensky, who's fighting for democracy and freedom. In the perennial struggle for democracy and freedom. It's not just a fight for Ukraine, but a fight for democracy and a fight for freedom. It is literally a battle for freedom and democracy themselves. It's about democracy. They are making a fight for democracy, for eternity, for all time. Your money is not charity. It's an investment in the global security and democracy that we handle in the most responsible way. Vladimir Zelensky is anything but an avatar of democracy. Zelensky's secret police have raided monasteries, even a convent full of nuns. He just announced that there would be no election in this beautiful and lovely democracy that we are defending in Ukraine. Чи будуть в Україні наступного року вибори? Це ж питання, якщо ми переможемо. And he is now using martial law to ban 11 different opposition parties. He is a dictator. He is a dangerous authoritarian who has used $100 billion in U.S. tax dollars to erect a one-party police state. It is also the role of the Department of Defense to ensure our nation's security. But our border is being ignored. Every single day our border is invaded by thousands and over 300 Americans die daily from fentanyl brought into our country by Mexican cartels.